Yeah, come on, let's get it. I'ma keep moving forward, no more looking back. I finally got my act together, take a look at that. Got tired of the devil taking the soul, taking back. I declare victory and got the Lord to thanks for that. I declare victory, I declare victory, I declare victory and got the Lord to thanks for that. I declare victory, I declare victory, I declare You're back! Hallelujah! Why y'all not here? Come on, let's go. Fire, 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 fire. Ooh, y'all looking good. Hey, I got to move it, move it. You got to move it. Hey, did y'all move it yesterday? I got to move it. You got to move it, move it. We got to move it. Move it. International ministry. Yeah. Hallelujah! Yeah. Did y'all win your game yesterday? Yeah. What's the score was? Three, Three one. one. Three one. Woo! Hallelujah! Still got that fire! Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Praise God! This Pastor Lewis from America too. He's traveling with me here. How y'all doing? Yeah. <laughs> so y'all ready to have fun, food, and fellowship? Oh man, y'all acting like y'all tired. Are y'all tired? Give me that ball. What's up with that? Something, something. Something, something. Let me see a little something, something. Since y'all ain't tired. Y'all look like y'all came and y'all just got this plane. I thought y'all were late yesterday. Bring the back. They're fired. What's good? Okay, we're trying to do something else. I'm not girlfriends, you guys are listen. First of all, you're kings. Kings wait until it's time for him to go get his queen. Not this and him, this one there, and this one there. Don't waste your time. Hey. Don't waste your body. <laughs> you are too precious. There's a lot of guys that wanted a dream and they got caught up with a baby too soon. It happens to all of us. You can't tell me you can have a girlfriend and y'all stay girlfriends and then you never have sex. That is not going to happen. <laughs> <laughs> that is not going to happen. So, I want you guys to be the ones that make a difference and make a stand that said that you can wait until it's time for you to make that happen. Because if you got a girl in your life, you're telling me you got a house, you got a job, and you're ready to have a wife. Because only street people and people that don't want really nothing out of life go to have girlfriend, 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 girlfriend. And you're bigger and better and better than that. You're kings on the moon. Am I right? Yes. You're not looking to just do anything. Anybody, you know, I don't know. I, I hope there's still some virgins in the house. Is there still in the virgins? I ain't going to look at nobody's face. There's still virgins in the house. Yes. Hallelujah. Woo! -hoo! <laughs> That is a blessing. <laughs> you know, people today, the devil has got people's minds so, so they think that's wrong because they didn't mess their body up. Because they didn't mess so their body up. But they, that is so, God loves that so much for his people to wait. And if you have messed up, you still can go back and say, Lord, forgive me, and you still will be a virgin. Now, I'm 58. My husband died in 2001. And I'll be 59 next uh, month. So, yes, I have children. And I didn't have sex before, I was married, and now I'm not. But from 2001 to 2019, I am a spiritual virgin. Hello, somebody. Hello, Hello somebody. Because this body don't belong to any and everybody. It belongs to God and whoever he will put in my life. And at this point, I got too much to do. I, can't, I don't even have time for that. Okay? So I don't even see that. I know I look, you know, kind of young and stuff like that. <laughs> I ain't thinking about the other stuff right now. I got too much. It's not even my mindset. My mindset is I'm planning 
I'm looking for land now. This time I came back looking for land. So I'm looking for land because I want to build a church and a soccer team. Hallelujah. A soccer team where we'll be fenced in. The soccer team, okay, it's going to be a church with 12 rooms up for somebody to stay. Downstairs will be a barber. I want y'all to, one reason I'm telling you is it's already on the paper. I bought a paper for y'all to look at. I'm telling you this because I want y'all to see it when you pray. I want you, because more prayer, more power. It'll help push it. It'll help bring it forward. So 12 rooms upstairs for somebody to live. Because downstairs will be a place where they have worship and a place where there will, and out on the corner will be a barber shop, a beauty shop, a restaurant, a masseuse, and a small gym type because the players got to have somewhere to do their thing at. And on top of that, the people, and it might be some of you guys, that will be jobs, not just church. That's what one would, uh, not just church people, but God's people. Kingdom is not just hallelujah, praise the Lord. Kingdom is moving forward where everybody will have something to do. You'll celebrate, I tolerate. So that will be a place for somebody to stay and a job for them to have to make sure the field and everything is being taken care of on a daily basis. There will be a fence around it. You will be your, this will be your uh, exception because you are the team that got hit, put this in my spirit because I keep hearing about where y'all gonna play it, where y'all gonna practice it. So you won't have to uh, pay or whatever to stay, but when you start having games there, we have to get those people and those children, whoever that is, to say it's gotta be something to come in there to play and it's gotta be something to come in there to practice. It might not be a big something, but every small something to help keep things moving forward, okay? That's what the plan is. I got, uh, that's why I'm here. The first thing is to find the land. Find the land and then start building. So I want you guys to put that in your spirit and um, know that that's what I'm doing here now. And it help me uh, pray it through and push it through. And uh, we'll be getting those things, the shoes and whatever else to keep y'all moving forward while that time will come. So, um, yeah. Hallelujah. That's a big one. Mm -hmm. And the shelf on the pad. The shelf on the pad. The wheel on the pad. I already got a few people that said that they're going to help me push it. I got one or two people that put something towards that. So it doesn't matter to me because sometimes people say, but when God gives, I want you to learn from me because sometimes I, uh, I, we make that mistake. I've made that mistake. When God gives you a vision, and somebody else don't support it. They can't see what to help you get stronger. Thank God for your haters. Thank God for the ones who say you cannot do it. Thank God because those are the ones that help you more than those ones beside you. Because when somebody tell me I can't do it, that's what I use to get me to make the other move because I'm going to show them that I can't do it. Okay? It's like a storm. Tell this story and then I'm going to hush. I need to hear from this one. It's like... This man, he, the bull was down. Y'all probably heard the story. Yeah. You heard the story about the bulls? Yeah. Tell me, tell the story. Yeah. Okay. The bull was in the hole. And the bull, they told the bull you'll never get up. So they kept throwing the dirt on the bull. How many heard the story? They threw dirt on the bull back. And he shook the dirt. And packed the dirt. And they kept talking about it. You'll never get up. You'll never be nothing. You shake it off and you pack it down. You ain't nothing but a bull. It's like somebody saying you ain't nobody. You said you was on, what soccer team? Where you going? You ain't doing nothing. You're wasting your time. You shake it off and pack it down. You still with that team? Y'all ain't even going here. What league y'all in? Who you say you coach is? What is this crazy that you're talking about? American lady gonna do what? You shake it off <laughs> Then they said, ah, she be talking all this stuff. Man, she ain't bought us nothing but a t-shirt and some shit. They shake it up and pack it down. After a while, all that dirt that they throw on you, all this time they said they could, that bull was looking them in the eye. And that same dirt they was using to pack, now he was on top of them, looking down on them. So all those haters will always be in your life. Thank God for them. You need them. So when they tell you, you can... And stop.
stand and stand and God, because you didn't, that you never heard me hear the Buddha say, who you think you're talking to? I'm this, I'm that, I can do this. You never heard the bull say anything. He just shook it up and pack it down. So when they say you can't, they say you won't, so thank you. Just shake it up and pack it down. Because one day they're going to look, they ain't going to be looking at you like this. They ain't going to be looking at you like that. They're going to be looking at you. How did you get that? All that time you was talking about me, I was using that dirt to shake it up and pack it down. Hallelujah. Amen. Give God a hand clap. So, talk to me. What y'all got to tell me? Start with the captain. How y'all been doing? And what we, which what ideas that came in your head? And with what I just said right now, how you think what we can do until we get that time that can help. Either one of those or all of those. For me, I think it's a beautiful project. And uh, we can't try to witness how it is. How it is. How it is in the future. Hallelujah. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. <laughs> Talk to me while I'm listening. For me, I'm happy for the project. Oh, see. And I, I am very eager to see what it's Hallelujah. Praise to the God. Yes. <laughs> this one, you had last year, man, you was on fire with that dream. I need to hear something because you, the one had started going to a different school or something, weren't you? What? Yeah. Tell me what you think and then tell me something about what's going on with you. First, we'd like to thank God for keeping us alive and kicking. The second thing is that we believe in you because we know that you want us uh, to build our dreams come true. Because most of here in Mombasa especially, people do drugs and such a things. So we hope that you will fulfill our dreams to be a professional person. Hallelujah! And what's going on with you? I'm still continuing yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. Hallelujah. Woo-hoo! Yeah. you here on earth, that means God got something else for you. You know, I, I'm 58, going to be 59. The devil didn't take these knees and this hip. I told you I've been praying for these knees. Okay. So, I could be saying, oh, I got enough money for myself. I don't have to do anything. Let me just stay here and go on vacation. You know, God gave me all this time. For me and myself, the devil is a liar. As long as you're here on earth and you finish an assignment, if God, if you want God to use you, you need to ask him, what is the next assignment? What else can I do? Okay? There's no retirement in the kingdom. Hallelujah. Yeah. Talk to me while I listen. Yeah, first, uh, I'd like to thank God. Thank you. Hallelujah. I'm still studying. I want to be a teacher. Woo! Hallelujah. Yeah. Talk to me while I listen. Hallelujah. Fire, yeah, 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 yeah. Woo, woo. Oh, thank God that we're here again. For me, I'm just. He will, but no girlfriend. Talk to me about it. Yeah, we thank God that you've come again in Kenya, and we promise you that we will work hard and we will improve ourselves. I'm in Form 4, and I want to be a pilot. <laughs> I'm happy to see you again. And I'm in four. This is my final year. Fire! Fire! What's up? 
first of all, I'm really happy to be here, and you may God give you long, long life to live. Um, I'm still learning. It, this is this is my final year. I'm in Tononoka School, and I want to be a businessman. Yes. We need all of that. What is he doing? Mm -hmm. uh, what is? But I'm just saying. Tell me, what is he still in school? Right. Yeah. Yeah. He's where? Two. 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 Yeah. Okay, he's doing good. Yeah. No girlfriend. Girlfriend. Yeah. Ah. <laughs> Hallelujah. I'm proud of you. Two players I'm so proud of you. I'm so happy. We start the um when we start when we find the land and start the project, I'm gonna be coming to you guys because there's some things uh, that y'all might can, you know, when the time to paint, when it's time for the bricks to be up, when it's time for some things that I might have y'all might can do that we might not have to get everything from the outside. Why should we have to pay somebody for everything outside? And some of that stuff we can do from on the inside. Okay? So that'll be good to know that, you know, some of the things, some of the very things that y'all doing, you know, um, with the, even with the engineer, because I'm waiting on this man now to draw. Uh, can you give me my, um, the you, iPad? The iPad. Let's see, I need, uh -huh. Somebody to um so everybody's in school though, that's the blessing, right? Yeah. Everybody's nobody just don't can't get in school or have any problems with school. Where's my um messenger? Your messenger? Yeah, we're And um this is y'all. We need new pictures. So if we take the pictures now, this is y'all when y'all was at the beginning. That's 2003. Oh, man. This is y'all a long time ago. So, so um, I was going to say something right quick about that. Um, oh, in the church. It's not just going to be a regular church. I believe in the arts. I write plays. I still teach dance, and I still dance. Did y'all see me? Who on my Facebook? Anybody on my Facebook? Some of y'all was on my Facebook. You was on my, you know my Facebook no more? You ain't see me. Y'all should have seen me out there doing my new dance. I was doing my new dance. Oh, yeah, let's do the dance. Let me take it out, put it up now. But I still teach dance. I still believe in the arts. I still write plays. I still write plays. Those things are gonna, um, when we have, when I say church, church is on Sunday, but through the week, the people are going to be learning how to play guitar, drums, whatever, have somebody there for that. And then we're going to have contests. The best um, dancer, the best um, uh, singer, the best uh, soccer player at that time. And those people will win. I think I, we talked about this one one time. Yeah. yeah. Those people will win. The best one will send that one for two weeks or so. It's to Germany or Africa or uh, Thailand. Even Thailand, guys. I'm gonna build a church in Thailand too. What? Man, well, those places, and it'll be a switch around. Be a switch around. Now I know. Uh, I think the majority of you guys are Muslim. Everybody's Muslim, right? Yeah. Is everybody Muslim? Yeah. Okay. So even if you participate in some of those things, as long as the music that you're singing or dancing to is positive in God music, so that's for everybody. You know, as long as the music is positive. And it's about God. So how would they sing, or they dance, or poetry, you know, poetry. So those things would be the talent, bringing the talent. And then the person who win will go to different places, even with the soccer team. And I pray when we do the soccer team that we, um, the, uh, the, try to get the, 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 the more of the the pros or whatever to hear about it, put things in the newspaper so they can come and pick some of the guys from the team. And the ones that don't make a uh, pool in the area of the, the, the uh, country, they still can make pro 
in that community. Now, uh, not well, I'll call it both. They still can be the number one. Thank you, Lord Jesus, for engineers, teachers. I thank you for success. I thank you they will be successful and succeed in everything they put their hands to do. I thank you, Lord Jesus, for their life. I thank you that they're still healthy, their strength. I rebuke any devil, any situation, any circumstances that would distract them to take them off course. I thank you they will continue to be focused. They will continue to help one another. God, have your way. Move by your spirit in their life. Oh, God, bless their families. Bless their sisters and brothers. Oh, take care of them. If there's somebody sick in their family, they know we speak healing right now. We thank you, Lord Jesus, for the vision. We ask you to make it plain so when, when we think about it, we continue to pray about it. And God, we see it coming to pass. Lord, I ask you to take me to the land, take me to the very place, God, so we can be able to have that land. And not just take me to the land, God, let us have transportation so we can have a way to go back and forth. And we we'll keep giving money to uh, tutus and, and other things that we have our own transportation as well. And I thank you for them. I ask you to be with them, guide them. And Lord, let us now have fun, food, and fellowship and enjoy one another, God. I thank you for them. I love them so much. It's in Jesus' name I pray all these things. Amen, amen, amen. Fire! I miss y'all. Reach out and touch somebody's hand. Make this world a better place. While you can, reach out and touch somebody's hand. Make this world a better place. While you can, reach out and touch somebody's hand. Make this world a better place while you can reach out and touch somebody's hand. Make this world a better place while you can reach out and touch somebody's hand. Make this world a better place while you can. Um, I don't um. <laughs> Okay, let me say again, then we'll sing it all together. And then Pastor Jacob's going to bless the food. But I will, before I get ready to exit, I would love to uh, uh, pray over you guys. And that's the be with the team. These are uh, uh, part of my family, pastors, prophets, uh, teachers, preachers, mamas, daddy, brothers, and sisters. These are the best soccer team players in Kenya. Yeah. And... I have some, my, my, if so, I'm so blessed. I have two of my uh, sons here from Uganda. You see them with the camera. But God blessed me so well. Not only did he send some guys from uh, Uganda with me, I understand my team have a Uganda on the team. Woo! <laughs> hey, that's God. And another international. And the Lib, how can you say it? But help me say it right. Is it called Liberia. Harambe? Liberia. The other Har one. Harambe, East Africa. <laughs> <laughs> no, Liberia, Liberia. Where's my Liberia? Another. Liberia. Say it for me. Namibia. Namibia. Wow. So we're international. Hallelujah. Amen. That's God. Amen. That is God. Amen. International team. We're going to sing that song before I go. Before I go, but not now. We're going to say great. And we'll be back at you, because I have a son everywhere we go, everybody will know who we are international. So Pastor Jacob, can you bless us? Can you bless us uh, as we reach out and touch somebody's hand? Can you bless us, please? And uh, Swahili, since I'm the only one that don't know it, so you can do it in Swahili. Okay, Mamba. Baba Majeshi, Kaliga Jina La Yesu, Mwana wa Mungu wa Ishiye Milele. Kakushukuru kwa sababu ya masa kama haya na deka hii mfalme wa mani. Kwa tumeshikana mikono kama jamii moja, kama familia moja. Nikili shukuru jina lako na kikili abudu jina lako kumfalme. Sande kwa sababu ya kikao hiki, sande kwa sababu ya kutuunganisha pamoja mfalme wa mani. Pokea sifa na utukufu na eshima na adhama mtakatifu wa izaili jina lako. Nikazwili kubarikiwa na kuinoliwa kwa mana we ni mungu wa maajabu. Tenda mema wakabili kila kitu mikononi mwako mchana wa leo ili mfalme wa mani kaweze kutawala asande kwa sababu ya vyakula vikombe letu 
Asante kwa sababu ya kila jambo iko mbele yetu. Umebariki katika jina la Yesu. Maana wewe ni Mungu mwaminifu. Kwa jina la Yesu Kristo tumeomba na kuamini. Amen. 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 Now tell me what was fun. <laughs> tell me what was fun. He wants to pray? Yeah. <laughs> no, what was funny? Okay. When we said grace, we were saying grace to our Father to the bless our food. But what was funny? I just want to know the joke so I can know. <laughs> Hello, somebody. Hello. Okay, so when, we, when we're honoring our God, however we honor Him, you know, if there's a joke, let us do it afterwards. Now, I, I know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got that fire, fire. showed me when I got to Africa that how can they how can anybody say this is a third world country look at the place I'm at right now every car that's on the road that's built even cars I don't know is on this road Africans are busy every day they're entrepreneurs they would take some off the ground and make it and have a business not only that when I was a young girl you know what they told me they said eat everything on your plate because people in Africa are starving that's what they told me so when I got to Africa, you know what I learned? They don't even eat leftover food. They eat fresh food every day. So that was a lie. That's the other thing that we was lied about. Somebody had told uh, people that they are third world. And I want somebody to please tell me what a third world country is. 